there are times when you might want to download Parcel to a, an Excel spreadsheet for further analysis. We can do that by selecting our properties. Let's use drawing the shape on the map at this point. And we'll just select a few parcels in our view. We're going to apply. And our results will be shown in the ellipsis. We can view them in the attribute table, of course. But the other thing that we can do is download them to a comma delimited file. We'll choose that option at this point. They went up here to the download area. Now your machine might be set up to download things from the internet uh, in different ways. Mine go to the C drive and my download folder. Let's open Excel and get a blank worksheet. We'll go to File and we want to open, but we want to browse to find our file. And mine is in the Downloads area. All files will be necessary. And let's just go to this one. Now this is important. You must have this text import wizard to handle Ottertail County leading zeros on their parcel number. So delimited is fine. My data has headers. Next, you want to choose the comma. Text qualifier should be the quote. Next, here's where it's, it's very important. Click on the column that you see pins and change that to text. If you don't, the parcel number will be treated as a very large number and it will cut off the leading zeros. The other two fields that are important to do this to would be the M zip 4 Make sure you change it to text because there are leading zeros in a mailing zip. And the other one would be this one, the P zip 4 Change that to text and say finish. And you will see that our parcel numbers come out just fine. Now you can save it wherever you would like to store your data and analyze away.